Hi everyone, thanks so much for coming back to my channel. This is Tina with Tina's Craft Creations. I am on today with a project share to show you some things that I've made today for the Mix Maggie and May series. Um, now, if by the time you've seen this video, this is my third um, project share. So the second project share, I had shown some projects that I made using the Maggie Holmes Carousel and Round Trip Collections. So I went ahead and kept those two collections out and today I decided to pull out Sweet Story and mix them with Round Trip and carousel so um, I went ahead and made some more embellishments and a couple of tag flips so I'm going to show you the tag flips first now I did go ahead and use some of that trim that I just recently hauled on Timu the pink and the green like textured it's almost like a thread with like little tiny tassels tied off of it um, so on this first tag and I did just had um, cut apart and things from the collection um, sweet story is I think the base of most of the paper from the, these and then I just used embellishments from the other two collections now this little embellishment here on the front of this tag was actually gifted to me I'm so sorry I don't remember who gifted this to me but um, I've had it stored with my sweet story stuff um, I did however deconstruct it a tiny little bit it did have some um, like holographic uh, like a um, like a florally type of die cut uh, behind the butterfly. I pulled the butterfly off, took the holographic piece off, and um, glued it back down. Um, I'm not personally one to mix metallics. I like gold with projects, or I like holographic or silver. I don't like to mix them. So I took the holographic piece off, but I did um, use the main part of the embellishment. Um, the little butterfly is from Sweet Story. Uh, I'm not sure where this little sentiment tag is from. It's not from the Sweet Story chipboard for sure, but it was just an embellishment that I had from someone. Um, and then the little butter or the little bumblebee is from the Sweet Story um, puffies again that was already part of this embellishment i just added the little gold enamel dot on this little tag i did stitch across the bottom i added two little puffy uh, ladybugs from the um sweet story uh, puffy stickers and then some more of my favorite gold enamel dots from the um from hobby lobby so i used that embellishment there now on this one I used a bunch of different elements. Um, I have, again, the paper is from Sweet Story. I used some ephemera, or not ephemera, but some like layering pieces, like tickets and things from the carousel collection. The two little floral pieces and the um, little uh, chipboard bumblebees are from Round Trip, as is the little tiny, oh wait, those from Round Trip? I don't remember now. I, I can't remember. <laughs> it might be from Sweet Story. And then I added a tiny little bumblebee. I think that actually is from Sweet Story. And then um, this two little t labels I just took. I think these were from Sweet Story. Added some gold thread and some enamel dots from my stash. So I used a very well-rounded mix of three the three collections from this particular piece. All right, this one here, I did actually stitch some um, heart trim on the bottom of this. This is trim that I got from, I think it was Home Goods at Valentine's Day. It's this really cool like Mylar heart trim. So I wanted to use it for these. I thought it would look really good with these collections. This is another one of those little embellishments I had in my stash. It also had, um, it had a little sentiment here, but I took that off because I wanted to change it up and add something else. So um, again, I'm so sorry. I don't remember who gave me these embellishments, um, but I did use the main part of the embellishment. I added a new sentiment and then one of this is just from my stash. I was starting to run low on sentiments from the three collections. So I went ahead and pulled out those little gold um gold foiled um, sentiment packs that I have from Tuesday morning from like years ago. Um, one of those a little enamel stickers from um, Carousel. Some more. This little ticket here is from Round Trip and this one's from Carousel. And then I added a puffy from uh, Puffy Rainbow and some little stars from the uh, Sweet Story collection and then again some enamel dots. So again I used a very well-rounded mix of all three collections on this one and of course I have glue strings course I do. All right. Um, this one here, I just took a base cut apart from Sweet Story, added one of the little Sweet Story butterflies. This lovely piece is, I believe, also from Sweet Story. Added some enamel dots and I called it good on that one. And I stitched all around. This one, I took the cute little giraffe from Sweet Story, added some of that little banner sticker from Carousel from the cardstock stickers. Those little puffy hearts, I believe, were from... Hmm... Sweet story, maybe. I honestly can't remember. I'm so sorry. I'm just like mixing them all and I just can't remember. All right, this one here, I used a cut apart from Sweet Story, added this little um, butterfly, puffed up its wings, used another one of those little uh, gold foiled stickers, added some gold thread and some enamel dots. 
And this one it was also an embellishment I had in my stash stored with Sweet Story. I'm so sorry. I don't remember who gave this to me either. I don't know if it was the same person. Um, but I went ahead and just used the entire embellishment. I thought it was really, really cute. Um, added this Sun and Fun from the Round Trip uh, cardstock stickers. And then some enamel dots from my stash. So, And then I did some like straight and zigzag stitching on this one. So that is the first tag flip. All right, and then the second one, I used some more of that thread, which is the blue and the aqua. All right, so this one here, I used a um, cotton candy cart from the carousel collection, some little labels. I believe these are from the carousel cardstock stickers. Um, this little piece here was um, also from one of those embellishments. I think I had pulled it off of something. I can't remember now. I like to deconstruct embellishments sometimes that people send me and then just use them in different ways, like the little pieces. Uh, this Hay Sugar is um, a um, Karis, or no, it's a Sweet Story um, digital um, piece and then a little uh, puffy ice cream cone and um, strawberry from the Sweet Story collection. I think the little stars are also from Sweet Story, the little puffies. Um, I did actually use quite a bit of my collections today. I ended up using the rest of the chipboard from Carousel and Sweet Story that I had, so I had to pull out new ones. Um, I used up what I had left of those little um, Sweet Story butterflies. Um, I used... Um, hmm. There was something else that I used up, like completely used up, but um, yeah, so this is the first tag. This one here, I did make this little um, cut apart a shaker. Uh, I just stitched some tool on and added some sequin mix. Added one of those little puffy um, hearts from just a um, general Maggie Holmes collection. This is, um, this, this little sentiment here was on one of those embellishments that someone had sent me. I again pulled it off and used it in a different way. Added some enamel dots and called it good on that one. All right, here on this one, I have um, a rosette from Lori, added some Sweet Story chipboard, this little like blueberry, and then this little raspberry or strawberry is one of those rubber pieces from Sweet Story. This I Love You sentiment is from Carousel, this little gold bow is from Sweet Story, and the little puffy strawberry is also from Sweet Story. And then again, some enamel dots from my stash, and I just stitched all of these little cut aparts and tags and things. All right, this one here, I used a... Um, I added some more of that trim. I really love this trim. It's so cute. Um, I used a little um, black and white photo from the round trip cardstock stickers. This is one of those little um, flare buttons that I have in, that I got from a woman on Etsy. It's a carousel paper. Uh, I added another one of those little gold um, foiled sentiments with some gold thread and some more enamel dots. All right. Um... This one here, I added again another black and white photo. This is a chipboard piece from Sweet um, from Round Trip. Um, yes, did I say that was from Round Trip? <laughs> this one was from Round Trip too. Um, this one is from Round Trip. I added a chipboard bow from the Carousel chipboard. This little sweet doggy is from the Sweet Story um, chipboard. Added a little puppy bow from the Sweet Story collection onto him. And then uh, this little pink banner is from the Carousel. The little sticky pad. Um, embellishment pack um that joy sentiment is just one of those little stickers that i have from tuesday morning and then some enamel dots and then the is this the last one i have a couple more so this one here i just took oh that's another thing i used that the last pack um i still have more of them but as far as what i had out for today i did use the last one of these little rosettes from the sweet story collection so i did use um, a rosette from the sweet story collection added the um watermelon orange and sh and sh cherries and i um clustered those together on top of the um rosette those are all from sweet story and then the two little stars are from carousel chipboard the little blue star is from round trip and then those little um label stickers are also from round trip added some gold thread and some enamel dots this one here i just took this um little swan um cut apart added some more of that trim put a little puffy bow on her and added some enamel dots and that's all I did on that one. So that's all I did for those two um, tag flips. All right, and then I did pull up, pull out a dough, a dough, a dye that I have in my stash and I'm pretty sure I got this from Scrap Diva a couple years ago. Um, it's like a little banner type of dye. Um, so I just, again, most of the, well, the base of these is gold foiled paper and then all of the, um, the, Patterned cardstock is from Sweet Story. Actually, no, I'm sorry. There's one paint, one piece, one of these that has a paper from Round Trip, but the rest of them are Sweet Story. 
All right, so here I used um, another little butterfly that I had in my stash from the round trip collection. Someone had gifted those to me. I'm so sorry, I don't remember who. Um, this is a chipboard camera from the carousel collection. Those little stars are from round trip. The little smile is again from those stickers from Tuesday morning and then some enamel dots from my stash and some gold thread. Okay, this one here, um, this one I used this little um, frame, which is from Round Trip. It has a little heart that I did not use, but I just wanted to use the heart frame. The little B is from Sweet Story. The little Love, I believe, is from Round Trip. Um, the thickers, and then the little enamel dots. This one here, I added a floral ephemera piece from Round Trip. The little uh, rubber floral is from Sweet Story. This little floral here is from Sweet Story Chipboard. Added a tiny little um, puffy ladybug from the Sweet Story collection, some gold uh, enamel dots, and some gold thread. And then the sentiment, obviously, from Tuesday morning. Okay, this one here, I just added another or a rosette from Lori, um, the Sweet Story ephemera um, little gumball machine. This little bow is from Carousel. Um, added a couple of little heart stickers from the Round Trip Thickers. Hey, again from Tuesday morning, the gold thread, and some enamel dots from my stash. Okay, this one here, I took a floral um, thicker from the round, uh, round Trip collection, um, added this little... Um, Ladybug from the Sweet Story chipboard. Loved, I think, is also from Round Trip. I I think. <laughs> um, the two little hearts, I believe, are from Sweet Story. I can't remember now. I'm just getting them all mixed up now. But and then some enamel dots from my stash. I know the little puffy heart is from Sweet Story um, Puffies, but I can't remember about the the two um, like the puffy hearts, the aqua and that peach. No, Hendrix, I don't have anything for you, bud. Um, and then here I just added again another uh, rosette from Lori, some um, the uh, butterfly, the ladybug, and this ladybug are all from Sweet Story, chipboard, um, and then thickers, and then this little heart is from the thickers from Round Trip. Uh, this little label in the back is from Sweet Story, I believe. I think it was uh, one of the last ones I had before I threw that uh, chipboard sheet away. Um, this little happy day is from those Tuesday morning stickers. Again, another little puffy ladybug from Sweet Story and some gold enamel dots. Here's another one. I added again another rosette from Lori, some more butterflies from Sweet Story, uh, a gold, gold glittered heart from Carousel. These, um, this little hand-drawn star and the puffy um, butterfly are from the sweet story chipboard and puffy stickers again another sentiment sticker from tuesday morning and enamel dots and then the last one is this one here i used a little tag um chipboard from round trip added some little tickets from carousel now all of the little fruits are from a variety of collections the puffies the small tiny little puffies um these two and these two are from sweet story this one here is from round trip both of these chipboard fruit slices or fruit pieces are from chipboard from sweet story and then this little so sweet is actually from a what did i pull that off of um Oh, it was on the rosette, the rosette from um, Sweet Story that I used in my tag flip. Um, the This one here, it actually had this sentiment on it, but I took it off and wanted to use it on an embellishment. So I added it there and then again, some enamel dots for my sash. So that is everything that I made with the Sweet Story round trip and carousel collections for the Mix Maggie and May um, series. This is going to be video three. So you guys will see this very soon. Um, I have, I still, today's May 4th. So um, I probably, I'm just filming ahead. So you guys will see videos over time um, for over the course of the month. If anyone does have any questions, please let me know. If you've not already, I'd greatly appreciate if you would consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.